Hi everyone, it's Stephanie. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are starting off a weekly vlog. It is October 30th. Tomorrow is Halloween and I currently just got back from the grocery store with my mom. Um, I just did a, got a little groceries for the week because we're trying to slowly get back onto this health kick. It's been really hard for me. I kind of had like the last two days been really stuck in like a rut. Like I just have had zero motivation to do literally anything it was just a rough two days for me to be honest so i'm just kind of like trying to ease back into things and slowly get back onto a routine where i feel good and feel great anyways just got back from the store i have filmed a shein haul my camera battery is flashing at me love that for me i filmed the shein haul i have to go edit that today so that i can have that up tomorrow and then I'm gonna clean up my room. So I'm probably gonna clean up my room then edit my Shein video. So that's what I'm doing. Hello, welcome to the vlog. Just coming on here because my camera is going to die, but I am cleaning out my closet and let me turn this brightness down. I just put a ton of things up over on Poshmark. I have the pile literally right here of all the stuff that's going on Poshmark. I do have other stuff currently on there already. I'll have my Poshmark link down below, adding a ton of clothes on there. Definitely go check it out. I'm also watching Love is Blind. I'm on the seventh episode of season three. Um, all of these people should not be together. Like, none of them get along. And this is like the worst season ever. I didn't even watch season two because I didn't care about it. But this season is like even worse. What are these people doing together? Like, literally, there is no connection between any of these people it just it's giving desperate and it's like you should never settle for somebody ever and i feel like all of these people are settling it's ridiculous but that's my two cents on love is blind this show is so stupid let me know what you guys think of love is blind in the comments below good morning everybody it is monday morning it is halloween so happy halloween let my hair air dry for like an hour already this morning like you guys my hair is I have no product in it, but it is just getting so curly. Like we are getting ringlets, uh, but I'm going to blow out my hair because that's usually what I do. Today's weather is just, it's very gloomy outside. I want to watch a Halloween movie. I'm gonna watch Halloween Town and like put it on in the background as I work because I need to get all the spooky vibes. I watched Dark Shadows this weekend with Johnny Depp in it and I was like, I've never seen the movie because I'm just not like a scary movie. I know it's not really a scary movie. It's like considered like a comedy, but I'm just not a scary movie person. I don't really like scary stuff on Halloween, but I love Halloween. Like I think it's so fun. I don't really watch a lot of those types of movies, but I wanted to watch it because obviously it's Johnny Depp and we love Johnny Depp. So um, I watched it and it was so good and I liked it so much. So I just want to like watch all the Halloween stuff on Disney Plus today and i'm gonna give out candy later which i'm excited to see all the trick-or-treaters i'm probably gonna throw on my Minnie mouse ears because i love to wear those on halloween so anyways i'm gonna use my revlon styler use this when your hair is like almost dry guys do not use this on soaking wet hair because you will fry the out of your hair okay so let's do this it would help stephanie if you would plug it in DHL delivery driver just came to the door and I got my really big cup she package that I'm gonna film it's gonna be some holiday stuff it'll be up in the next week or so but I'll show you guys a little preview the vlog gets to see the goods first this is a top which I loved the color cup she has been doing clothing so well so this is the top I thought this was so cute for the holidays to do like, 
I like like that vibrant like pink in the holidays with like a nice silver like bling necklace. I think that's gonna be so nice. So that's a little sneak peek of the haul. I don't wanna give too much away. So the next package that I got is a designer dupe bag and I'm really excited about this one. This has to be one of the favorite ones that I have because it is so out of what I normally would get. So this is by the brand website Koe Bags. It's C-O-E-E -E Bags dot S-U. Reading it off my little email from them. Um, they went ahead and sent over one of their best sellers to me and I am so excited about this bag. You guys can see it is a Balenciaga bag. So they decided that they were going to give my viewers a coupon code when you guys purchase your very own. If you use the code Steph C, you'll get 13% off your order. Perfect in time for Christmas if you know that someone likes a designer bag but you don't want to spend like the full designer bag money, definitely check out this website. There's so many to choose from for the holidays and this bag is going to be a really good holiday bag that you're going to want. So let's go ahead and unbox this together. up here so that I can give you guys the best like glimmering light of this bag so here it is like you can see the sparkles in all its glory like how gorgeous is this bag let me can see the rhinestones are all the way around the bag anyone that knows me loves I knows I love glitz and glamour and this is just giving it like look at the detail the quality you just cannot beat it. And then look at this beautiful buckle detailing here, the little closure. It has a B for Balenciaga. Even that has little like glistened rhinestones in it. Inside of this bag smells and feels like genuine leather. Guys, it's everything. I just, I love it. You can see it says Balenciaga there. This is what I would call a work of art. Like, hello, we are gonna be glitzy, glam, flashy gaudy for the holiday season what i also love is it comes with the adjustable um strap here so you can see it has a bunch of different settings here so you can go ahead and put that into any size that you want the bag to hang from so then all you would have to do is just clip these on at the top you would just strap the little strap on so you can wear it like a crossbody if you wanted to i don't think i i mean i would probably even where it is a crossbody, it, do, it does go a little bit longer. But I think this is absolutely so, so beautiful. I mean, this is just speaking volumes for itself. Like this is absolutely gorgeous. Thank you to coeebags.su for sending me this beautiful bag. I cannot wait to use it for the holiday season. Like I said, I do have a coupon code with them. It's just Steph C and you will get 13% off your order. So definitely check them out. I'm obsessed with this. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous bag. Okay guys, it is later in the day. <laughs> My mom's over here and she's already shaking her head no. And you know why she's shaking her head no? No to being on camera. Uh, I've got my Minnie Mouse ears on for the festivities. Cause you know, any chance you can wear your mouse ears, we're gonna wear them. Um, I'm right now gonna get onto my Amazon storefront and I'm going to start looking for Holiday stuff that I can link over there. Um, it's never too early to start doing that And if you guys didn't know I do have an Amazon storefront page I will link it down below in the description box. It's always there You can shop all of my Amazon favorites and stuff like that And I also make curated lists of shopping things. So like right now I'm working on a holiday dress um, Section on Amazon so check it out. It will be linked down below But I just wanted to pop in let me show you guys the candy that we have this year this is the candy. We have Snickers, Twix, Starburst, 
um, M&M's, and then we just have Tootsie Pop um, suckers because that's all Target had. Like I said earlier in the vlog, they had other bags of candy that were like $34. R ridiculous. But anyways, mom and I are making, well my mom basically did. She made spaghetti squash with chicken. So I'll show you guys what that looks like when we have dinner. Hello, Hello friends. So it is Thursday, November 10th. I haven't vlogged since last Tuesday, which was the week of Halloween. Um, so we're gonna include this in today's vlog, but it is about 5 p.m. I'm currently watching Popcorn Planet. They're live streaming. Um, I am just got out of work and I am about to start getting ready because I'm going to see Demi Lovato tonight. So I'm very excited finally getting to use the tickets because they, um, she rescheduled this tour date. If you guys saw my vlog from a few weeks ago, last month actually she rescheduled her concert for Chicago because she was sick. So um, we're going to that tonight. So I'm very excited. So I'm going to go ahead and get ready because I have like two hours to get ready. Um, but I wanted to film a couple TikToks if possible. So let's do our makeup i am all dressed here's my outfit i did a whole tiktok as well so if you guys don't follow me on tiktok definitely make sure you do but top is shein bottoms are legging um leggings oh my gosh the bottom is a full leather skirt from amazon my tights are from amazon and then my boots are from tj maxx but you can get them on amazon now my jewelry is i have like these cross earrings they're from amazon my hoops are from amazon <laughs> This is brought to you by Amazon. Um, my necklace is actually Walmart, and then I'm wearing my Bella Luck charms, rings, bracelets, what I always wear, Apple Watch, and I'm gonna throw on my Levi jacket from Amazon as well. I will have all this stuff linked on my Amazon storefront if you wanna shop this outfit, but this is the look, and it's about, it's about that time to leave. Hopefully my camera stays. I just got into the parking lot. I just paid to park. It was $25, you know. These concerts, they're... Gotta pay to park everywhere these days. But um, yeah, so I just got here. When I pulled in, it was like crazy because they had like the line, the line was like wrapped around the building and I'm sorry, but I'm not trying to wait outside for like ever. So I think I'm just gonna chill in my car for a little bit. But um, yes, if you're wondering, I am at this concert alone. Um, if you're new to my channel, um, I sometimes will go to concerts by myself because I feel like I've just always been the type of person, and I don't know if anyone else can relate to this, but I've always been the type of person that people just don't like the same things that I like. Um, they don't have the same interests as I do, and I kind of came to a point when I was like, I don't want to like not do things in life because I have to do them by myself. So here we are going to Demi Lovato's concert and I'm so excited. And if you are new to my channel, you would know that I've been to about four Jonas Brothers shows by myself. It's just, it's nice to go alone, but it also can be kind of lonely, but I don't mind it. Um, just sitting in the parking lot because the doors opened, I think at seven, but the line was so long. Since we're here, let's chat a little bit because I haven't like talked to you guys that much. Cause saying tonight I'm using my Fenty Gloss it's in the shade Fussy. It's Fenty Beauty and we, it's not focusing because this lighting is atrocious. Out here supporting Rihanna because she is supporting Johnny Depp having him in her Savage X Fenty fashion show and it was absolutely amazing. My mouth like dropped when I saw Johnny. He looked so good and I am just... I, on a tangent about Johnny Depp, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys will know I'm like a huge fan. I absolutely love, love, love Johnny. I adore him. I think he is such a kind, kind soul. And everything that he's been through, it's just so incredibly empowering and just so emotional to just see him, you know, support him as he's rising again because he deserves it. And I just, I loved that Savage X Fenty fashion show moment for him. It was great. I think this, um, like... Amazon uh, crossbody bag from yeah Amazon it's like the Lululemon dupe so that's what we're wearing I threw on my Levi jacket because like I don't know sometimes I tend to get like cold before the show starts because it's like opening act and like the air conditioning's pumping so also oh my god I watched love is blind comment down below what you guys think about this whole Cole and the cutie situation um, unpopular opinion here but team Cole because that situation was just 
Th that's a video for a whole other day. I can't even get into it because it's just way too much. Let me know what your opinions are if you watch Love is Blind. Um, also, I upgraded my seats. I was originally like further back, but I finessed myself on Ticketmaster and got sixth row so we're gonna rock it out um and i have an aisle seat again so that's great i like see people walking by oh if you guys don't know this about ticketmaster if you buy a seat that is we'll just we're gonna use basic pricing here if you buy a seat that's fifty dollars and the day of your show or like a few days before your show sometimes on ticketmaster if you keep checking tickets pop up randomly this happened to me at the johnny depp and jeff beck concert as well which is why my mom and i got our seats closer but if you go on the website and you see a ticket that is priced at the same ticket that you bought yours for or more you can go ahead and upgrade your seat for ten dollars plus the additional fees for the seat so if i wait, paid fifty dollars for my ticket and i saw that they had seven rows closer for sixty dollars then i would pay the additional ten dollars for the transfer fee and then the ten dollars to upgrade the seat so um like the difference in the seat if that makes sense so i paid whatever i paid i forgot what i paid for these seats but i ended up upgrading my seats because it was the same price um and i looked like not even too long ago just to keep checking to see if um any like seats would pop up in the pit just like randomly because like sometimes that happens where they like randomly will appear and i just like to keep checking because you know sometimes people can't make it to the show or you know sh stuff happens but they do right now have like a ton of floor seats available and i just feel like it's a tip that like a lot of people don't know about so i mean here i am giving my concert ticket tips but it worked for me when i went and saw johnny depp and jeff beck i upgraded my seats and me and my mom got amazing seats so but anyways that's that i think i'm gonna go try to head in in like five minutes or so so i'm gonna text my mom let her know i'm here so see you guys inside Demi Lovato concert it was a really good concert it was so good to see Demi back on stage and just finally like hearing the music live like always a concert is always like so good to go to but um yeah so right now I'm about to take off my makeup taking off my contacts first and my makeup and then I'm going to go to bed because I'm so exhausted I will probably film an outro tomorrow morning because i'm just like so tired um this vlog was like all over the place um but we're gonna take off our makeup and go to bed i'll see you guys in the morning good morning everybody so it is the day after the concert and i'm looking a little rough this morning but your girl is so tired but i just wanted to come on here and end the vlog and just talk about the concert a little bit um it was a really good show i really enjoyed seeing demi haven't seen her in a long time so it was really really good show i had a lot of fun um i had really good seats really enjoyed it so i probably entered all of the clips that i wanted to show you guys from the show but um i really enjoyed when she sang a lot of her older music i've like loved demi and it just brought me back to like middle school days and how much i loved her music so overall really really good show um but i am now have the day off today it's friday so i have a ton of filming that has to get done today and i also 
um really really need to go run some errands i need to go to target i need to go buy a new hairbrush my hairbrush broke but anyways i'm gonna end this vlog and start a new one for the next week but thank you guys so much for watching and i will see all of your beautiful faces in my next video bye